Everybody. Welcome back to a brand new episode of Let's Retro Monster Rancher Vance 2. Now you might be wondering, what in the world I just did? I just fused Gara with Pavirus of all people. You see, the thing is, those weren't the originals. I made brand new ones, and I got them as high as they could stat-wise. I took every single lesson that I've learned so far in terms of raising your monsters to maximum stats very seriously. And it took me a while, but I almost got them there. They were in the upper eight to nine hundreds apiece. They were all the way up in S rank before they eventually capped out and said, okay, that's it. I can't train any further. So I put them back in there and I decided why not fuse them into something. So there we go. This is our new Zan. Let's go ahead and check him out. I'm actually curious to see what kind of stats he has. So he has tough skin, so he reduces damage, but harder to dodge attacks. So his speed's kind of low, probably. Increases power, accuracy, and tolerance of mind moves. Moves these claws. A warrior that excels in all stats. You see that elite? I like. It makes training him much easier. So he's got three near moves. Not bad. But I do like that his stats start out so high. That I do like. Oh, he sounds like a machine. That's so cool. I'm gonna put him in the studio real quick. I'm gonna freeze him up. And I'm gonna show off Raiju. See, remember I told you there was a monster that I did successfully, well, I don't think I should mention it. Raiju, I did successfully make it to 9,000, or 999 max stats. There he is. God, did that take very precise timing, and I had to, like, save in between each training session in case trainings failed, just to make sure that he got maximum stats. That took way longer than it should. As you see, it's year 12 now. This took me, like, five, six days of just straight grinding. It took forever, but I got it. However, what I'm going to do with him is I'm going to make him into a coach because he definitely doesn't have much longer left. Uh, no, I wish to turn him into one. What I meant to do was coach, register, yes. So he'll be able to train my other monsters. So I like the fact that Raiju will actually be coaching my other monsters in the game and I don't have to worry about having another coach to try to train them. Yes, thank you. We're going to decide what coach, which training he's going to do. Since he's maximum stats, he could train at literally anything. So let's go ahead and do... Yes, you're really suited for this training. That's no surprise. Power and defense. Why don't you do life and power as well? Hmm, okay, so it doesn't say you're suited for that one. It doesn't say you're suited for that one either. Really suited for this one though, so I'll assign you there. Hmm. Let's see. Really suited to this one. Doesn't say anything about being suited for that one. Wait, where did I just assign you? Smash up? Are you are you actually good for smash up? Alright, suited for that training. Okay. So I have him doing smash up, flip, sandbag, pinhead. I would assume he'd be good at body blow, right? Yeah, he's good at body blow too. Nice. Now, are you good at anything else? Like towing? Hmm, doesn't say that, but I'll assign you there anyway. Alright, so that's good enough. You know, I got a monster now being able to train my other monsters into higher levels. Let's go ahead and revive Viper here. And now I have Viper. 
Now we go to the ranch. Let's see. Since you're good at training all stats, let's start with the ones that you're actually really good at already. Because I've realized now to get to the S rank tournaments, you definitely want to be not just level 10, because it looks like it's about 50 uh, points per level, because the level cap for stats is 999. It's not just 50 roughly per level. You want to get to around eight to nine hundred before you can start taking on the S rank tournaments, and then around or at least around six hundred in all stats before you want to take those guys on. Because if you don't, you end up losing really hard. Nice. Good job. Good job, Viper. All right, Viper. Let's go ahead and do a battle. So I don't think I'll go very far with Viper today because I've I've been playing this game all day today. So I might do a tournament or two, then just go ahead and just do the rest of his stuff off screen. But let's see how much damage he can do with his two moves. All right, you know, good chunk, good chunk. Oh, some saw. Oh, oh. Leg arc. Oh, you missed. Oh, the wing slap. Good dodge. Well, bam. Good job, Sam. Or Viper. I actually like that. So I also found out there is a fast forward button. It's just a space bar. I can hold that and I'll just speed through this. Not the most useful dodge. But it can be helpful when it's like those scripted battles where you can't do anything about it. Oh, the somersault missed. Come on, come on, do something. Nice dodge. Somersault. Ooh, hit him with the moonsault. Hit him with the leg arc. I said hit him with the leg arc, not miss him with the leg arc. Oh, that's his first hit. It's the first time he's been hit. Nice. Good hit. Good hit. I'm liking his damage, not gonna lie. With just one training session, he's actually hitting like 40s and 50s. Okay, now you're getting hit a little too much, buddy. I don't appreciate that. And you're down. Nice. Good job, Viper. All right, just one more. Let's take her down. As soon as I fast forward, I get smacked. Double leg arc, and you miss. Let's make it a triple leg arc. And you hit this time. I, I think she's a little mad. Hmm. Leg arc, smack in the face. Dodge it, no, not like this. Oh, no, 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 no. Dodge a somersault. Nice. Let's show a real somersault. Boom. And down goes Asuka. Nice. Good job, Viper. We are now the Rising Dragon Champion. All right, let's see what you improved with. Accuracy and speed. Nice. Good job, Viper. You and your robotic sounds. Sleep so weird. But I love it. I love Viper. <laughs> Viper's so cool. Alright, let's see. Did you. Oh my god, he stepped back and just launched it. Good job, Viper. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna praise it. What do you even like to eat? You're a robot. You like vitamins. Huh. You literally don't like anything else other than vitamins. I mean, I guess, because you don't eat. Hi right there. Loyase, what you find in the ad? Sales training, what a surprise. It is there. Yup, of course there is. It's one of these in this month. 
let's take on this tribe tournament first. Which means I should be up against only Vipers or only Zans. Yep, only Zans. Interesting. Let's see how this goes. Man, my stats dwarf yours in like all regards. I feel bad. Nail slash. Interesting. Oh, you trying to stab me, boy? Hit a somersault. I missed the somersault. And I hit him with the leg arc. Ooh, the counter. Get smacked in the mouth, my guy. Leg arc. And I miss. I'ma just, I'ma just, uh, I'ma just, uh, hey, 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 hey. Aw, oh, shice. Oh, I guess that worked. Bye bye, thing. And Viper wins. Man, some of these Zans actually look pretty cool. Let's see. I even love his like slow motion pimp walk, whether it's forward or backwards. He walks like he's Dio walking up to Jojo. Hey. Take the summer south. Holy moly, I'm doing some damage. I just uh, gotten kerfuffled. Leg arc. Hit her all. She's confused. It didn't work. Oh, she returned the favor. It's getting real. Dodge it. Yeah. No. Stay back. Stay back. Stay back. Stay back. Stay back. Stay back. The Gurk. Oh, the kick to the mouth. Oh, that was dangerously close. I'm good. I'm good. That that counter saved my life. Nightwish just looks sick. I'm not gonna lie. I don't even know. What is it like a Naga with a Zan? Oh Jesus Christ. Take that kick to the mouth. Holy moly, I just half helped you with a somersault. And you should be down. Oh, almost down. 2 HP. Mmm. That hurts. That stings. There we go. Oh, bam. KO, boy. Perfect sweep. Good job. Holy moly. Good good god. Viper is just disgustingly powerful. Good job, Viper. I actually like this. I, I think this is who I'm going to take all the way through the end of the game. Alright. Viper, you go ahead and get some rest, my guy. We'll go ahead and do the official E once again, just to get that going. And then that's it. Let's see. Can we see how strong you've become? Yes, we shall. Let's go. Enter the tournament. I'm still mad early before I can do S rank stuff, but I should be able to do E rank with no problem, actually. All right, we're just going to skip through all that stuff. Leg arc, leg arc, leg arc. Confusion. Leg arc. There we go. Wait, you have my colors. Excuse me? Are you a Zan hybrid? Is that what I'm witnessing here? Stay back. There can only be one. There can only be one. Yes, I win. Okay. Alright, come on, Lars. Take that leg arc. Take the leg arcs. I'm not gonna take that fire upper, though. Take that leg arc again. Oh, it's a sealed combo. Uh-uh. Oh, I might lose. Oh my god, I actually lost a round. Cursed accuracy. Oh, 
I'm staying back for a minute. Oh, come on. I mean, I won, but... I need Lars to lose a match. Okay, maybe it was a little too early. Okay, good damage, good damage. There we go. Come on, Lars, lose a match, man. There we go, that one's down. Ah, oh, Lars didn't lose a match. Okay, I got second. I'll take it. Alright, that wasn't too bad. Good job, Viper. Alright. I'll give you some potatoes. But that'll be it for this week's episode of let or today's episode of Let's Retro Monster Rancher Advance 2, guys. There will be another one tomorrow. And by then I'll be S rank, most likely. But you know, I'm going to do that just to make it easier on myself. I won't have much time to record for the rest of this week. So I will leave that for tomorrow. Now, other than that, guys, I will catch you here next time on Let's Retro Monster Rancher Advance 2. If you liked today's episode, go ahead and give it a thumbs up. Leave a comment down below. Hit the subscribe button if you like today's episode that much. And I will catch you all here next time on Let's Retro Monster Rancher Advance 2. If you, uh, if you want to try any kind of codes, please feel free to leave a comment down below and I will test them out and we'll see what we get together. Other than that, guys, I will catch you all here next time. This is the Afrolet signing out, and I hope you all have a great and wonderful day.